What up guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to be talking about the new Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, but this time it's going to be a little bit different. Now every single year I always discuss the new Call of Duty that's mysteriously, you know, releasing and being teased by Activision and this year is going to be the same thing, but it's going to be a little bit different. Now I'd say that Call of Duty and I have had a love-hate relationship over the past few years. Some of the games I've really enjoyed, other the other games I just haven't played at all. Uh, Black Ops 3, I enjoyed it during the beta and then I just stopped playing it after that. Uh, it's pretty unfortunate but you know i still kind of played on pc like every now and then but i don't really grind it like i did back in the day with like mw2 and cod4 and whatnot maybe that's just because like i had literally no life but uh who knows you know um <laughs> so today i'm gonna be talking about the things that i need in call of duty infinite warfare for me to enjoy it and just play it like non-stop you know because i really do miss cod uh like call of duty in my i guess life i guess you could say um in my gaming life i really do miss it uh i go back and play cod 4 and mw2 all the time and, and the nostalgia factor is like sky high so i think that it is you know it's gonna be a good thing that they're remastering cod 4 i think that is gonna get me by but i really do want to play a new call of duty now the reality is guys infinity ward could potentially fill that gap but they have to appeal to the og crowd which i don't think they're gonna do but nevertheless guys here is the list of my specs the infinite warfare has to have in order for me to play and enjoy the game now i'd say the first and biggest point for me would be the movement system hashtag fave for no exos um yeah so basically i want the game to be a boots on the ground gameplay style i don't want it to be these adhd you know dad dashing and double jumping and sliding and okay well the sliding is all right but uh i don't want to be able to wall run this is not titanfall this is call of duty i want to be able to worry about the gunfights and not the maneuvers that point right there is probably the biggest one for me and if it does not have a good movement system then i probably won't enjoy the game i want it to be this not this this not this please not this now for the next part the servers for this game better have at least a 64 tick server um that's like you know game wide i, I don't want to see anything but 64 tick currently they run on like these hybrid servers that are you know quote unquote dedicated but they also have p2p action as well and it's just a clusterfuck they run at like a really low tick rate i'm not even sure the exact tick rate but it's like really low I know my buddy Kai was talking about that, but yeah, I want the game to at least run at 64 tick or even 128 for competitive matches. That'd be the best thing to do, but uh, that's wishful thinking. I don't think that's going to actually happen. I think they're going to just stick to the roots because at the end of the day, they're in the business of making money and that would cost a lot more and the maintenance would be even worse. So, uh, you know, I think that's a big aspect that I'd like to have, but it's not a deal breaker. I think if they, if the game servers run perfectly fine with uh, whatever tick rate they use, then that's cool but if not then i want nothing to do with the game um now for this next point i want the game to have a good pc port if there's not a dedicated team working on a pc port then i am done with it man i do not want to see a call of duty game with another shit port ever uh because infinity ward released a mw2 port that's broken till this day but you know what guys at the end of the day i'm gonna give infinite warfare my attention activision infinity ward you have my attention uh once you guys show the game tomorrow sometime i will tell you if i give my you know seal of approval and if not then you know you're probably not gonna have me as a consumer and i'll just you know stick to the cod 4 remastered or wait i guess at the end of the day they're gonna get my money because i want to play cod 4 and nostalgia equals everything so yeah cool i guess that's all for this video guys if you enjoyed it be sure to let me know what you thought of it in the comment section below or by hitting the like button on this video thanks again for watching and i hope you guys have a nice day and i'm out peace Man, throughout this video, I said I'm not going to buy this game, and that's just not true at all, because COD 4 Remastered is, uh, is kind of a bundle with Infinite Warfare, so thanks Activision, you fucking marketing bastards and, and stuff, because I'm going to have to buy your game anyway, because you're a bunch of assholes, so yeah, I'm just not going to play your game, I'm going to snap it like I did Ghost, brother!